All right, y'all, in this video, we're gonna talk about how the Inspire 2 flies and handles in the air. So we're gonna take off, and right now we're in uh, P mode. Has been updated. Please landing gear raising. So when you let off the stick, it's rock solid. So if I move a little bit to the left and let go, it self levels, it counter corrects the direction and it stops and stays there, which is really nice. One thing that I noted in our video shoot this past weekend was how smooth it is, how precise it is. You can fly really slow, you can control the speed. Perfect. So it flies exceptionally smooth. I'm able to do even more precise uh, movements than I was able to with my S900 and the A2 from DJI. This is just one of the best flying and feeling drones that I've had. Everything is super smooth, if you're smooth on it, but at the same time, it gets up and going. So right now we're gonna go, we're doing, I'm gonna check the speed here. I'm gonna get down the runway. I'm gonna climb a little bit. We're gonna do some speed tests. Right now, this is P mode. We're gonna come right down the runway. There's 20 miles an hour, 25 miles an hour, 30 miles an hour. 33 miles an hour and it's scooting along pretty good and that's all you know perfectly smooth and stable and the camera is rock solid all right we're gonna pump it up to addy mode right now we have no uh, gps positioning so it will move around uh, with the wind and drift but now we're gonna go full speed in addy mode and it's a good bit faster there's 42 miles an hour 46 49 53, 54, and I'm having to stop because we're just running out of field here. <laughs> this thing is awesome. Alright, here we go. Full speed forward in sport mode. <laughs> 50 miles an hour, 51, it is hauling butt. So the nice thing about the Inspire 2 is you have a lot of adjustments over how it feels. So if, if you don't like the way it feels, if it's too sensitive or um, you want it more sensitive, you have exponential adjustments, you have uh, braking adjustments, how aggressive it uh, basically stops movement when you let go of the sticks. Um, you can fine tune this to fly however you want it to fly, which is really nice because before you basically were just stuck with how it handled and that was it but now you can really fine-tune it uh, exceptionally well to however you like and even down to the point of how fast it will descend so if I go up a little bit and it's got lots of power guys I mean that's a really fast climb 13 mile an hour climb and I think I have it set to seven or eight uh, meters per second down so if we descend um, it comes down really smooth but also really fast You're gonna get a little bit of buffeting, that's just natural as it flies through its own wake. But you can even fine tune that vertical descent speed in the app, so it's just really amazing. I love how this thing flies, I love how it handles. It is better than the S900 that I've got. It is smoother, it's more precise, it is more agile, it's faster. It's basically got everything that I could want in a drone for handling as a pilot operator doing aerial filming. It just feels really, really good. So the throttle basically, uh, if you're not familiar with the DJI drone and how they work, uh, the throttle doesn't control speed. It's the, the, the right stick's gonna control your forward, backward, left, right speed. All throttle's gonna do is control the altitude. So if you wanna go higher, you can basically give it more throttle and climb. If you want to come down, you give it less throttle. The speed stays the same, just the altitude is the only thing that changes. And you can even tweak the exponential and how aggressive or sensitive uh, that altitude adjustment feels. So they did a really, really good job with setting this thing up, making it fly right. And it just looks awesome in the air, flies awesome in the air. So I actually just couldn't be more pleased with how this thing is handling. Um, it just really doesn't get much better than this. So that's gonna conclude this video on the flight characteristics and we're gonna put her down and start the next one.